So you're thinking of starting your own business. Maybe you need to rent an office space, hire staff, or build a website. To do this, you may need to borrow money. How does a lender, for example, a bank, decide if they want to lend you the money? Well, the banks and other lenders will evaluate your credit to determine whether you're likely to pay back your debt. What is credit and why is it so important? Put simply, credit is the ability to borrow money to obtain goods or services with the understanding that you'll pay it back later. It includes things like using your credit card to shop online, getting a student loan to pay for school, buying or leasing a car, or getting a mortgage to buy a home. When you use credit, you're establishing a credit history, which is a record of your past and current use of credit products, payments, and personal information. Did you know that if you're late paying your credit card bill, miss a car payment, or default on your mortgage or student loans, your credit rating can suffer? On the other hand, maybe you have auto payments set up, or you remember to pay your bills on time, every time. Either way, this information is all stored as part of your credit history. Your credit history is used to determine your credit score. Your history and your score are both contained within your credit report. In Canada, there are two credit reporting agencies, Equifax and TransUnion. They each use their own ways of calculating your likelihood of repaying debt, which is based on your credit report. Lenders use these credit reports as a factor in their decision to extend credit and if so, how much? Simple, right? It's important to understand what is in your credit report and ensure it's correct because it's used by lenders to determine your financial worthiness. Sometimes your credit report can contain errors. Errors could give lenders the wrong impression and you may be turned down for financing or be charged a higher interest rate. More seriously, errors can be a sign that someone is trying to steal your identity. They could be trying to open credit cards, mortgages, or other loans under your name. It's a good idea to check your credit report at least once a year and be on the lookout for any errors, such as mistakes in your personal information, errors in credit card and loan accounts, like a payment you made that is not reflected in your report, lingering negative information that remains on your file beyond the maximum number of years permitted, or accounts listed that you have never opened. If you do notice an error or suspicious activity, you should call the credit reporting agencies and the creditor in question to sort it out. Now that you know what credit is, some of the things it can be used for, and how lenders determined whether they'll extend you credit, you're probably wondering about your credit score. Futurepreneur has that covered in another video.